We just collected the last debt and now we're on our way back to pay it forward. Well, not pay it forward, but you know what I'm trying to say. I don't want that long ride over here. Oh, to the camp funds. Oh. Hello. 163. That was all thanks to me. We had $63 in there. The man has the acoustic guitar ready to rock and roll. It's post Sydney. It was going to like the the house of the owl. Arthur Morgan. You hear John Marston back there. Oh, wait a minute. And camp upgrades. What do we have here? Silver, buncle, 100 cash. I believe I gave the most. No, Karen? She, no, that was a dollar. Yeah, I donated the most so far. 15 cent, <laughs> John. Um, all right. Medicine wagon increases total supplies, includes thing. Um, why not? It's only 30, but wait a minute. For me, or? Ooh, hello. How did you get on, Herr Morgan? Fine. Our accounts are up to date. Side sacks, a lot of them. Good, very good. My pleasure. Uh, well, if it's pleasure you're after, there is one other. This farmer preacher fellow I met in Valentine, Mr. Downs. The opinionated little do-gooder? Yeah, I know the one. I certainly know the type. Thank you, Herr Morgan. There's no need to thank me. Like you said, it's pleasure I'm after. He's more slippery than he seems. I've tried being polite. Don't take any nonsense. Nonsense? Me? If he doesn't have the money, beat him. Well, I usually do. I know. I know. <laughs> One more debt. What is this pulsating over here? Wait a minute. Didn't I just talk to him? What's over here for me? Inspect. This, this is not what I need to do. Oh. I've written this letter a hundred times or more, and I cannot get it right. It's me. You know it's me from the bad handwriting. I know I said when we last spoke, and I was going off to get married, that we would not speak again. I know I said a lot of things, and I meant them, I suppose, at the time. But I'm not so proud as to not speak to people who care for me, or cared for me. I've been in Valentine for a couple of months. I had some bad luck, and, well, it's a long story, and not an interesting one. But I am here for now. Mary? I saw a couple of the girls, or whatever the polite term is for them, that ran with you and your associates in town. And I heard tell of a man who sounded like you. I would love to see you again. If you could spare me a little bit of your time. I'm renting a room at Chadwick Farm, just north of Valentine. Yours, Mary Linton. Bumblebee tuna. What does he want? Well, she's post-stating, but let me... I'm gonna do... Crap, I don't know which one I want to do first. Do I want to take care of her? Or do another one of his missions? Uh, it's on the way. Let's do this one first.
pep in your step, sir. They had the like subtitle songs, the subtitle of their song they're singing kept popping up. I'm like, dude, I can't keep track of what she's saying. I wanted to read the subtitle. I'm like, wait a minute, she's saying this other stuff or no? It was a mystery. Ooh. Watch out for the chicken, sir. Don't step on them with your hoof. It's like something's gonna pop out, like Luigi Mansion or something. Like I'm like riding into a a graveyard somewhere. Probably my own. Riding on the side of the riverbed. Hey, buddy, I don't have time for that. No, no. I'm okay. Oh, uh, what does he want? I got bit. Oh, God. I need medicine or a siphon. Suck the venom out. Oh, man. He's this is getting, this is, this is getting serious. Let's give him. Drink this. I was gonna try to suck it out, but I was like, you know what? Never mind. Medicine. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Oh, you saved my life. I owe you. You're welcome. That right. I do. Uh, now I, I gotta get out of here. Uh, uh, don't much like it around here no more. Glad I could help. Keep your eyes on the ground, huh? Huh, all right. This just went up. Yeah. Well, I'm almost. I'm like, <laughs> I'm on the negative side right now. A few more good deeds like that, and I'll be on this trail to a positive life where fortune, fame, and glory reign. I don't even know what word I just said there. I'm making up stuff. Up the hill we go. I almost missed my turn. That right turn at Albuquerque. Dude, I didn't even know when I was younger. I thought Bugs Bunny just said Albuquerque just to be funny. I didn't know it was an actual place. I can jump on the horses too. Ooh. Wait, did what's over here? Oh, that person. That I'm gonna get in trouble and shoot somebody over. Here we go. I don't know, I went this. Whoa, I don't know what that was. Something like fell on my foot. I'm not about to yell his name again. He's in the house, obviously. Can I look in the window? Alright, he's not in there. Oh, uh, retreat it there for Mr. Oh, that's what I'm trying to do. Oh, he's over here. Like, he heard me calling his name. Mr. Thomas Downs? Yep, that's me. You owe me money. Uh, oh, no, no, I'm, I'm, I'm... You can try to swing if you want to. We ain't a charity, Mr. Downs. Oh, come here, you maggot. Please, sir. I'm... I'll... Really? Threaten me, would you? Oh, please. I have a family, sir. Please. I don't care about your family. Why did it have to come to this, huh? Believe me, sir. I didn't want this either. You ain't such a do-gooder, are you? If you're running out on debts... I'm about to punch him. I'm not running anywhere. I'm... I'm... I'm, do I'm doing my best for you. All right, that's too long. Give me the money, man. All right. Come on. All right, I'm listening. What do you got to Mr. say? Strauss seems so understanding. 
Okay. Your dad's caught you, mister. And it ain't letting go. Be reasonable. <laughs> You borrowed money from my business partner, Herr Strauss. You owe him, you took the money. He wants it back, what's not to understand? <laughs> oh. Where's our money? I don't have it. Sell your place. We already owe more than it's worth. <coughs> then sell your wife, or your family, or something. We ain't your idea of charity. Is that clear? <laughs> What are you looking at? Thomas! I said what you looking at, woman! My husband isn't well! If we could just have more... Like I said, we ain't nobody's idea of charity. Get us the money! Okay. Now I'm off to Valentine. Riding off into, uh... He just, like, beat that man unconscious and just rolled out. What is this? Uh oh. The plot she thickens. Maybe he, he feels remorse or something now. Somebody's after me. Oh, or not. Where am I at? What is that? To the dot we go, sir. Oh. Oh, maybe I'm going to talk to him about that particular debt. And tell him, hey man, it's not worth it. Leave that guy alone. Nobody talk to me. Wax on, wax off. Why can't I run over here? Oh, and then he wants to slow to a crawl. Ah, how did you get on? Not so good. He's almost dead. And they seem more or less destitute. You were a fool for lending them the money. Then, people who aren't desperate don't seem so interested in my propositions. Of course. Oh, that was it. All right. Ho ho. Now I'm gonna head off to oh well, not that. Lisa was it? Mary. Let's go see my flame and Mary. Oh, he started the full sprint, and then he stopped. On my way to see Mary. Is that the sun? What is that? It's like a like a light or a beacon or something. I'm gonna transfer to when I get to Mary. We have arrived at our destination. So gotta go see who we gotta kill now. Or oh, what trouble she's in. Wanted to run off and get married. Yes? Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to disturb you, ma'am. Um, is, um, is Mrs. Linton in? I'll go see. Mrs. Linton? for you man she meant business oh hello Arthur hello Mary um. I heard you and your friends was around I okay where's what's his name died well I'm sorry to hear that yeah me too Happened a while ago. Pneumonia. Bad business. Sure. So, uh, you've been 
You've been made a widow, and you come here looking for me, is that it? No, ain't like that, Arthur. Oh, okay. I... My family. I need your help. You mean the family that always looked down on me? You want me to help? It's my little brother, Jamie. <laughs> I always liked Jamie. At least compared to the rest of them. He's broken Daddy's heart. Daddy has a heart. Don't make me beg you, Arthur. My money, my life, me. I wasn't good enough. I'm sorry. We need your help real bad. Little Jamie's joined the Chelonians, that strange religious order. Good for him. They're quite mad, Arthur. They'll kill him. You're the only person he'd listen to. So, I'm too rough to marry into your family, but it's okay to ask me to help in saving your family. I'm sorry. I understand if you don't want to help me, but... But I think of you often. A long time ago now. I'm begging you, Arthur. I say let Jamie live Jamie's life and not the nightmare that his daddy dreamed up for him. Jamie's so innocent, Arthur. Please, Arthur. Will you help me? Ah, uh, boy. Where is it? Somewhere out near Carmody Dell, I think. The rancher there said he'd seen him around the Cumberland Forest area. I just want him back, Arthur. If you find him, bring him to me at the station. I'll see what I can do. I'll owe you. You already owe me. Give me six hundred dollars and it's a done deal. Somewhere in this general area is where they're sending me. So another transition. This is the last favor she gets. Dude, I feel like I'm gonna be in a dilemma like this, and I'm gonna be like throwing up old stuff, just like he was throwing up old stuff. So oh. I wasn't good enough, but you want me to help. Uh, I can relate to this mission a lot. Dude. This one is hitting home. It's too much. I don't want to get into too much detail. But if I was in his shoes, I would do the same thing. Well, I made the decision, so... Whoa. But I don't want to get anywhere near those guys. Well, since I know how to do the bullet time now, or the dead shot, it's not so much a problem. But I don't want to. If there's no cover, and I don't want my horse to die. Uh, I said I was going to transition. I didn't do it. You're stuck with me on this ride, ladies and gentlemen. I believe we're almost there. Yep. Look at that. He even, Arthur even agreed with me. We're almost there. Are we actually almost there? We are actually almost there. If I just cut. Mm, no. There's a giant rock formation here. Can I cut through the middle? Um, I can cut through here, can I? Let's do it. Let's do it. Your horse is agitated by predators. What predator? Yeah, that's it, 
boy. Relax. Watch out for that tree. Watch out for that tree. Oh, Tarzan. Ah, uh, whoa, whoa. I forgot the, like, um, actor's name. He played in, um, ah, what is that other movie? Darn it. Mummy. Um, I forgot his name, but that was, I like those movies. Did I just go, like, the wrong way? I was going towards that H. I'm gonna have to shoot somebody. Oh, relax, relax, relax. Up here in this remote area. What is that? Oh, it's a bird. I just like, saw some shadow. Alrighty, here we go. Alright. Um, let's go ahead and go to that harsh cargo. Goodness. I just want the gun, really. Um, dro oh, okay, droppings. Just in case things get crazy. Which one is Jamie? That must be Jamie with the fanny pack. Chelsea. Gonna speak to the boy? Arthur? Hello, son. Your sister is very worried. The boy has chosen a path, sir. The path to truth. Nah, don't make me shoot you. Well, I mean, his sister just wants to speak with him. Arthur? I've chosen a path. The boy has chosen a path. He's chosen safety. What path have you chosen, sir? Oh, uh, that's a little impatient. I don't know about this nonsense. Let me speak to the boy. Dut, dut. Are you always this negative and antagonistic, sir? Can I shoot him? I'm not a very cultured man. Forgive me, please. <laughs> I am a fool for my God and a happy one, sir. I bless you. What do I dream about? Who are my heroes? Fools. Uh, turtles? I have no idea. Um, uh, turtles. Yeah, turtles. Hey, yeah. We love <laughs> turtles. I love them too. Turtles. <laughs> um. Jamie knows the truth. But of course, you may speak with him. Exactly. If your teachings are so great, what harm can I do? I'm... I'm not... I'm not coming with you, Arthur! Just come and speak with Mary, then make up your mind! <laughs> Leave me alone, Arthur! I didn't ask for your help! Do I lasso him? Oh, goodness, he's hitting those corners, boy. Let me, uh, whip out that lasso. Oh crap, left or right, left or right, left or right. Sorry. Oh, what? What did you do to my horse? Did you see that? I was a lot closer. Come on. Oh, Jamie, your sister's worried about you. I don't have to answer to you. 
Don't I have the fastest horse, dude? Like, what are you doing? I was a lot closer to that first one. If I could lasso this guy. Ah. Uh, Come on, you ain't stupid. You can see this is crazy. You're the crazy one. Yeah. Just stop. Let's talk about this. I was doing just fine by myself. I can't lasso him. I think I'm a little bit closer. Ah, oh, that jump stopped me. What are you gonna do, Jamie? Live the rest of your life in the mountains with those people? They're my come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah! What are you talking about? You ain't no killer. You don't know who I am. Oh my goodness. Oh crap. Please, Arthur. I'm a man now. I, I, I found something. A calling. You're just a kid. You're making a big mistake. I'm not taking advice from you. You're an outlaw. You leave me alone. They're good people. I'm warning you, Arthur Morgan. Leave me alone! Please, kid. Put that gun down. I warn you, Arthur! I'm... I'm gonna... I don't wanna live anymore! Kid, just calm down. Leave me alone! Oh crap. He's gonna do it. Go see your sister. Okay. <laughs> okay. I don't think he was gonna do it anyway. Okay, kid. Have I been a terrible fool, Arthur? I don't know. I don't know enough about it. But one thing I do know. There ain't no shame in looking for a better world. I missed you, Arthur. Are you and Mary sweet on one another again? Oh, no. That's all a long time ago, son. Yeah. Well, this wasn't how I thought today would turn out. It's Me either. It's been a long time, Jamie Gillis. You were a kid last time I saw you. You didn't try to kill yourself. You know, you taught me how to ride a horse. Too well, apparently. Salonia, though? Really? You'd fall for that? They were very nice to me. They're decent. I'm sure. Please tell me you didn't give them any money. Of course I did. They rely on charitable donations. <laughs> Jesus, Jamie, come on. I just wanted to believe that there might be something good coming my way one day. Guess that's dead in the water. With the turtle. Shut up. <laughs> All father kept telling me was, you won't amount to anything. You're not enough of a man. I had to get away. I couldn't take it anymore. Forgive me, but your father's a bully and a coward. Don't listen to him. Hey, don't talk about him like that. <laughs> what do you want me to say, Jamie? He's a good father? Nice man? He won't be happy I saw you. Please send him my worst regards. <laughs> oh, a bridge. He's right. I'm not good at anything. You'll find something. Oh, that ain't true. Tell me something you like. Um, well, um, Don't think too hard. Apples, I guess. Apples? Yeah, I love apples. Okay. I was thinking more along the lines of carpentry or horses or something. You can have apple farm. All right, go work in an orchard. By that token, you must really like shooting and robbing people. I only like shooting young idiots who run away from me when I'm trying to help them. <laughs> Father told me what you do. I'm sure he did. Hey, are you still with Dutch and what was his name? H Hester? Oh, 
say? Yep, still the <laughs> same, sort of. And Annabelle and Bessie? I'm afraid they're dead. Shit. Maybe Mary did make the right choice. <laughs> no doubt. But none of it is anything like the nonsense you read in the newspapers. So, are you two getting back together? I told you, no. Just ask me for a favor. Here we are. She must be waiting in. What wrong, baby? Inside. Hello, sir. Put that down. I, I forgot how to put it on my back. Oh, there it goes. Jamie! Jamie! Come home. Please. You've... Father's been very sad. My father wouldn't know sadness if it died in his bed. But I'll come home for you. My boy. My sweet boy. Come on. Oh, Arthur, thank you. Thank you. It's good to see you, Mary. And you, Arthur. And you. I've... You're... Oh, you'll never change. I know that. I feel like the luckiest man alive, and I feel like a fool. That woman confuses me and plays me for a fiddle like no one else alive. I trust I will not make a god-awful fool of myself once more, but... Somehow, I imagine I shall. Dude, these undertone messages, I can't take them. But, I'd like to thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe, comment, tell your mom, tell your dad, because they're out there getting everyone. Because they're out there getting everyone. Later.